Hey guys, what's up? It's Jen. Welcome back to another Create Your Own American Girl doll episode. So I got some more requests and I wanted to fulfill them. So we're just going to get started. The first doll that a lot of people wanted was Merida. So we're going to go ahead and create a masterpiece. I don't know why this doll is always default. We're just going to start with hair. All right, as you know, Merida has very red hair. This is absolutely iconic. They didn't really have her true red hair color, but next we have her haircut and it is definitely long and curly like really crazy curly that kind of looks really close to merida okay i think this is more accurate her face she has very blue eyes like really true blue she does have freckles we're gonna go back and change her face i think i think c is a good one for merida and her outfit is very adventure style she's wearing a blue dress but we don't really have a blue dress so we're gonna go with this dress i'm gonna go ahead and name her her favorite place would probably be the mountains and fave things because she really is in archery um we might just skip the pet honestly. So here's Merida. I think she turned out really cute. I would definitely order this doll. So the next doll we're going to make is Belle and she's fairly easy to make. She always has a really nice simple look to her and her hair is a brown color but that kind of looks like a different color brown and she has got really long pretty long wavy-ish hair that definitely looks more like Belle even though the hairstyle isn't really Belle and now we're gonna go on to her facial facial features beautiful brown eyes let's go into face okay we're gonna go with B and now moving on to outfits someone commented that I stuck them in the same outfit but I mean you don't really have much to work with here so she's still princess and her personality of course I'm gonna name her favorite place it'd probably be the library but there isn't really an option for that so the city will have to do reading and writing that's so bell so here's bell I think she looks really cute and I don't know if American Girl doll has a doll like this. So the next doll we're going to do is Ariel and I don't know why I didn't think of doing Ariel before. Ariel is such a cute mermaid so we're going to start with her hair of course. It's iconic red. It, it's This doesn't even do it justification but still Ariel has long wavy hair. We're going to go on to facial features now. I think we're going to give her we're going to give her this face and moving on to outfits. My gosh, literally is like the same outfit. Don't hate me. We're going to stick her in that though. Okay, there we go. Ariel, favorite place. This is a dead giveaway. The beach, of course. Music and dance. I'm just going to say music and dance because that seems very let's give her a cat even though they don't have a fish here is lovely ariel i wish they had a mermaid costume i think they had one a few years ago but here she is she's looking very cute i love it okay actually the last doll that i'm going to create is mulan i love the message she gives out in her movie give her black hair and she has very straight long and straight hair well she does cut it in the movie but i think Okay, actually that that looks good we're gonna stick with that face shape and she has brown eyes dark brown eyes i think she looks good in this outfit it's a very warrior <laughs> like outfit favorite place probably like out in the woods or something and a pet pal we're gonna give her a dog here's the last character mulan she looks very cute and a lot like me she'd probably be my look alike so thank you for watching this episode and i hope you guys have a fantastic day please comment down below what your favorite disney character princess or whoever is and let me know and i think that's gonna wrap up this episode so thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day bye <laughs>